So right now we're doing a bunch of work on our project F82M4 and we thought it'd be a really good time to talk to you about the split cooling system on this car. There's a high temp coolant circuit for the engine and a low temp coolant circuit for the charge cooler on top of the engine. So that means there's two different radiators. And in this case, there's three different water pumps. You have a mechanical water pump up there. You have an electric water pump here, an electric water pump here. What's what? Well, the mechanical water pumps for the engine. So when the engine's running, it's flowing coolant through. And then you have your after run pump down here, which is going to continue to cycle coolant through the engine, even after the engine has been shut off, which is very important in case the turbos are hot or the coolant temps are high. Now you have this other larger electric water pump up here, and this is the sole pump responsible for flowing coolant through the low temp coolant circuit. If you were to disconnect any coolant circuit hose, no matter what, I highly recommend that you check both the low temp tiny expansion tank and the high temp expansion tank, which is the big one, to make sure that you didn't inadvertently drain the other system. All of these individual parts are available at fcpro.com for the F80, F82, F83, SF5 power BMWs, and F87.